question for us okay like okay how to convert java object into an json string the more you start thinking you will get more things okay now you can go to internet you can search about all that how to do that and in the code we have found one of the way of doing it there might be multiple ways but thinking is more important ki why it is required because simple java object we are not giving we are always encouraging spring json to pass the way postman say it's happening that's the basic criteria of this uh, microservice communication json object string passing from source to destination now in order to do that if you see here we are using something called as json dot to json which takes object as the input and maybe converts it into a json okay now the point is we don't have json with us right now let's take the reference what exactly is this json so we are going to this code from where we copied that okay and here here json is available it's a simple object which we are creating and if you see it's a google library so google team has provided a library called as com.google.json.json which helps to convert our object into a json object json string fine so now let's try to use this okay so using this we are creating i take it copy it again you will learn more once you take piece by piece this code and it will cause problems to you then you are trying to solve the problems by thinking you will get more smarter and more grip will come on these concepts when you deal with it in piece by piece okay fine now we need to create a json object by default it's giving error whenever object gives error by default what we do is control shift to let's try to see if our class path is already having then id will provide the import dependency so i'm doing control shift o and if you see the error is still there that means the jar which this is having is not there in our class path think this is what is happening if you do a control shift o if json is available as some jar in your class path build path of project it should automatically import here but if it is not importing that means it's not there with you or all of a sudden curiosity should come where is this class available which library it is there how can you get it and already common sense should start clicking for getting any jars in your class path you need to add a pom dependency but now the question is what pom dependency is required that is where let's try to check it take the reference think through it i'm doing f3 here okay and yes it is available as json.jar okay fine json.jar so maybe json.jar is something you can go to pom.xml here of this to get the exact jar dependency or you can go to maven from there you can get some jar dependency okay now let's say i'm going to maven okay json maven dependency we want to have json maven dependencies okay fine click here this is a step by step you need to think and solve any problem that you are getting because problems will go away only when you think and solve it otherwise error will be there for like oh, entire year because you are not solving it magic will not happen right when you change something then something changes okay fine let's come here let's try to take some latest table version json it's by google coming here they have provided some dependency take it up go back to your code open up your pom.xml we don't have it here control shift r pom.xml this is a project okay lombard dependency we added now we are adding json dependency because it converts java object into a json string fine again the id is suggesting okay, why go ahead with versions we will take care of that so this kind of symbol is coming it is telling us okay, duplicate or i fine so let's remove it and let's see okay fine i'm saving this let's try to save this okay go back to this code 
we have added the dependency hopefully now we are doing again a control shift o organized import control shift o just see error is gone save it again so step by step if it is not there it will cause error if it is there it will not cause error that's how you build system that's how you think and do stuff okay fine now we are just doing control shift k just to see the occurrence yeah it added com.google.json if you want to see whether it's there with you i'm doing an f3 on this and yes json it's there and it is available as the maven dependency for us in this project which we are coding so yes that worked okay let's come back so we solved one of the problem okay json problem is solved now the thing is it expects 